Today, it's the shortest versus tallest players in FIFA 22. You guys, now this works. Two teams put them up against each other in a career mode simulation, a kickoff mode simulation, and a vault the simulation tiebreaker if we need to. You know, a lot of people like to ask me my height. Actually, comment section like below right now. What do you guys, how tall do you think I am? I'll wait one second. Correct answer is approximately six foot three inches tall. Okay, not that any of you care about that. Let's build these teams. Before I get into this, I got something so dope to show you guys. My friends over at Exter reached out to me. Can we, camera, can we, can we focus? Yo, check this out right here. The world's largest smart wallet company. I've already unboxed it, but like, look at the packaging, bro. Okay, first off, link in the description. These wallets, this is the, the Exter. This is my old, like, just funky, oh crappy God, wallet. If you guys want to get one of these for yourself, there's a link in the description, discount code. You guys should pick one of these up for sure. Check this out, right? We got the cash in here. We got my ID. Yo, boys, look at this. You're thinking like, yo, where are your credit cards at? Where's all that? Watch this. Ready? You click this little button right here. Boom. Oh. I was getting so tired of this old wallet right here. Like just so clunky, just like so many things going on. Extra reached out and they're like, yo, can we send you a wallet? I'm like, sure, bro. This thing is incredible. Of course, we got to have the cash money in here as well right when you're done with your cards you literally just boom send them back down you can you know boom push them out again also in the back it's literally hiding right here but this is so cool pull it out and it is a tracking pad that will literally go to your phone and you can basically track your wallet if you ever lose it come in handy for me a lot because i have lost my wallet many a time scat cone link in the description pick up one of these bad boys for yourself and join the extra army ready boom that's just my favorite part right there. So how this is gonna work, we're gonna have a 20 players on each team. Oh, and a rule for this one. It is the smallest and tallest players, but you have to be at least 75 overall. So everyone on this team is 75 overall or higher. Team small first, they are gonna go on Toronto FC. Let's go, finally getting to do one on an MLS side, simply because this man right here is the smallest player in the game that is rated 75 overall or higher our first official signing of this team their goalkeeper they're about to get a bit unlucky because it's this guy named wax sellington wax sellington five foot ten makes him the smallest goalkeeper in the game 75 overall i'm, I'm gonna stop saying that but you just guys gotta remember it's only players who are 75 overall or higher up next we got four center backs five foot nine bustinza Bustinza. oh also before we get into this because you guys drop a like on today's video we are going to go today for approximately 26,262 likes on the dot. And if you guys could subscribe today and I'll give away my mini football, all right? This this mini football, I'll give it away. You have to subscribe though, all right? All of you. And what else? Let me give away something else on my desk. Uh, fingernail oh clippers, we'll give that away. And this right here, chat, tape measure, all right? So you guys got, if you subscribe and like, have a chance to win one of these, okay? There actually aren't a lot of small center backs like uh, for the most part like jenna i guess he's 5 10 too but he's next on the list you know this team's getting a few high rated players back to back 83 rated center backs is actually really good for this team and one more center back we are gonna go for martinez from ajax oh also i should note no icons guys in this one i'm sorry icons not gonna be included next up we're gonna have two left backs enzo Chisano. No, this might be one of the smallest players on the team. Five foot five. And the next one honestly doesn't even come close to our last guy. Cresswell is five nine. Okay, so for right backs, two of those as well. I believe this is one of them. Navarro is 75 overall in five foot five. The next man who I actually got to see play live when I went down to Argentina, Bustos from Independiente. I actually got the uh, the Independiente kit hanging up right here that I got in Argentina. Let's actually go find these next two manually because they're both in MLS, which is the same league that our team is in. First off, we go to New York City FC and I believe Morales, yes. Our first cam five. He is officially the smallest player on this team. Well, besides the guy already from Toronto. And then I get to go. Yo, my hometown club. Finally, I get to include FC Cincinnati in a video. We're terrible, but we have small players. So it's a dub for this video. Ocosta, he's actually really good. You know, I think up next, it's the one that I think a lot of you guys probably were of waiting for. How could we forget, man? I want to say the highest rated player on this team, Insigne. If this short team is going to win, they're going to need this man to absolutely carry them. And another super short player. Actually, no, this is the highest rated player on the team, Ferrolti. 
Oh, he's so small as well. Five foot five. Chat, be honest. How tall are you? Comment section. I want to hear from you. Like I said, I'm 6'3". Who is the tallest person who watches my videos? Let's be honest and everyone be truthful in the comments. Let's see who's the tallest. So I think this is just how it is. A lot of the like South American players, Central American players are all kind of the smallest. It's just... It's just, I mean, the majority of these players, you guys are going to see it from like Argentina. A lot of them are from Argentina, actually. I was, how is looking here? I think we got room for around five more players. I've been wrong all along. Another person who's going to make this team who's one of the smallest. I can't, I can't spell his name. I want to say the third smallest CDM in the game and Golo Conte will be included in this short team. I've just realized this team doesn't have a single striker. Here it is. This is the smallest 75 plus rated striker in the game. Manu Vallejo at five foot six. I think we need three strikers in total. Two more. And you guess who this is going to be? Inches. I have to spell like this or else his name won't come up. Here he is. He's a center forward, but Alexis is actually going to make this team. If only it was his rating from like five FIFAs ago. And one more for whatever reason. I think it's just Something to do with Napoli, bro. Dre, we're going to go with two center forwards. Dries Mertens makes it. And our last one for this team, one more midfielder. He's actually got some really good potential. Fran Beltran at 5'5". Let's figure out where we're putting all these boys. Now, I will say, this isn't the most impressive team. I mean, there's some good players. There's some not so good players. Obviously, we're going to have to go Insigne on the left. Since we have all these center forwards, what we should be playing here is a false nine. Mertens is going to be at center forward Conte Verratti already in they have Martinez and you know what we might keep him in the midfield two players down here on the bench I will say the CPU has done a pretty good job of arranging this team on their own at 75 rated keeper that could end up being the downfall of this club all right the tallest team in FIFA surprisingly is gonna go on Jenk simply because this man is the tallest 75 plus rated player in the game let's see how tall he is he's a striker he is approximately six foot seven well, i was thinking here the second player is going to be a goalkeeper and i was expecting it to be like a crazy good keeper each team only gets one goalkeeper and this is the tallest one so it's going to be very even both get a 75 overall keeper he's six seven as well okay my four center backs up next number one is going to be six foot six vestigard from leicester right we got dan burn six to six as well from brighton yo not gonna lie this bag line kind of i was expecting a lot better man only like slow 76 75 rated players they will get one decent one though in colts coats Cots. We're going to call him. We're going to call him Coates. Their highest rated left back is actually an interesting one. It's going to be Kolarov, man. This dude is an absolute tank. And I'm taller than him. How does that work? You're telling me if I was a left back and 75 rated, I could be in this team. That's ridiculous. How does that even work, man? See, I've gone for the highest rated players at every position. So even Spinazzola, he's only 6'1". What is that? Okay, that should not be a thing, man. A, I, I'm How? How am I taller than some of these guys? Okay, right backs. The first one is going to be Munier. Yo, so many inter players on this team. Domfri. Wait, I've spelled his name wrong. Here he is, Denzel Domfries. All right, I'm really hoping the midfield's a bit... The midfield has to be taller, right? I just think it had something to do with, like, all of the fullbacks. We'll start with a central midfielder. This is the tallest one in the game. 6'5". Okay, it's better. I think as, like, an American, I'm just really used to, like, watching sports like the NFL and NBA where, like, you have players who are, like, seven foot tall. Oh, my God, dude. This guy was in the video we did last week, which, if you didn't watch, you should watch. He was on a meme... We did what do we do? Meme FC versus Prison FC. He was on the meme team. Fellaini. We're going to take Berg, Berg, Sander, Sander Berg. And we'll go one more midfielder. Somehow this guy makes it. Ah, <sighs> Nemanja Matic. Where is he? 6-4. So far, I, I mean, the short team looks just miles better. Next up, left midfielders or left wingers. Thurum. Then this guy is about to be small. Trust me when I say this, small. Ocampos, the guy you pack a million times in Alton team. 6-2. Yeah, I mean, it's just like, I, I don't know. All right, right-sided players up next. We got our boy Zaniolo and the West Ham United. He used to have five-star skill, not anymore. Six foot three, same height as me. Let's go. Two strikers, let's finish this team. It will get a little better for the tall team. They're going to get Wegwars. Finally, let's end this with a bang. We're going for it. Zlatan Ibrahimovic is on this one. All right, let's set the starting 11 right here and get into this. What am I supposed to do here, boys? It's simply just not as good as the other team. 4-2-2 holding and make this the starting 11. Okay, before we get in, 
I have to tell you guys something. We are going to put two major twists into this video to give it a little extra spice. That would feel wrong if I didn't do this. So we only chose players 75 or above, but I feel like each team needs the actual smallest player in FIFA and the actual tallest player in FIFA. So this right here, if I can freaking find the man, is the official tallest player in FIFA. He's from Ipswich Town, Thomas Holy, and he is a approximately six foot nine and the smallest oh my god you have to go so back to find him all right it's, i think it's this man right here from pumas five foot one the smallest player in the game officially all right twist number two you guys are gonna have to wait till we get in the game to actually see oh wait the second twist i was gonna do i needed to be on pc i'm not on pc uh FIFA, man. I like to do stuff on like like the new consoles because the graphics are just so much better. When I do that, I can't I can't use the mods. It's all right. What I was gonna do basically was go and actually change their heights to make the tallest team maximum height, all of them, and the smallest team minimum height. But you know what? Now that I think about that, I'm kind of glad we weren't able to do that. Right here we go. Here's how the team matchups. It looks like the short team is favored. Uh, actually. It's pretty even. Yo, why do these these teams, their kits are actually so dope. Both of them, man. I need to get I need to get one of each. Let's go, boys. I need all of you to put your predictions down below. This is normally the time I would ask for my chat's predictions, but I am taking a week off of streaming before we move to Twitch TV. So link in the description, twitch.tv. If you guys want to check it out, follow there. Streams will be starting again very, very soon. Let's go, boys. I got to make my prediction. I'm taking... Since I'm not streaming either, I'm not going to be spinning the wheel if I lose. So this is just a prediction for fun. I'm tall. I, I mean, I would be in this tall team. I got to go for the, the I got to go for this team right here. Let's go, boys. Here we go into the match. Oh, another reason I use like next gen is because this dope camera angle, which I absolutely love. It just makes things seem so much more realistic. Here we go. First chance for the short team. You can actually tell the height difference a lot out there. Look how small some of these players are that are in the box, man. Oh, it's ridiculous. They actually might score, though. But I'll see not a chance or more watch this game i'm pretty happy i picked the tall team i mean yeah i was watching this game for literally 10 game 10 minutes of, of in game like 10 in game I, I can't speak but they scored i don't need to speak i just need them to score my horse come on him and slots on up front you love to see it what was i trying to say look at the pitch and you could just tell the difference oh heal the heal oh good skill almost beaten right there that might be how the short team wins they got to do it with skill team saw back on it can we see just a crazy goal from slots on today I would absolutely love nothing more than that. Oh my God, team small, bro. They're trying their little hearts out. <laughs> they just can't get a shot off. Gonna be another here that's all team, bro. All they gotta do is that. That's all they need to do is put crosses in, man. Team Saul again. Get it to slots on. Slots on. Shoot. Wiggers again. What has he done? Shoot the ball, bro. That's the half, bro. And you know what I've gathered from this first half? Oh, it must suck to be small. They're literally awful. In. Oh my God, team small, bro. They literally are just dumb. I swear, half of it's that they're small, and the other half is just that they're dumb. In Team Small! Oh my god! That was literally their chance right here. Oh, Trees Martins. So freaking close. I think it's funny that they're actually trying to score. If they scored from a corner, might be one of the funniest things. They shouldn't even attempt that. Less than 10 minutes, man. At best, what we can hope for is a penalty shootout. But this right here may end it. Why don't they just shoot the ball? Oh, that's a GG. There it is, Team Tall. I think what I think is going to happen is that in this next match, bro, in this next one. Oh, what am I trying to say? The career mode simulation. Team Small is going to be the team to be. Hey, my prediction's living up to its hype right now. What's a golasso? It's too little too late. Dude, have they even had a shot? This might be their first shot all game. They're not even going to get to shoot the ball. They're just shoot. They, they do not deserve that game at all. I gotta freaking see this. Did they have a shot? I want to know. Did I just sit here and watch a full game without a single shot from one team, bro? The hell? Who, who do they think they are? One total. When did that shot come? I'm trying to remember. And I can't. Oh, I do remember now. Okay, yeah. They did have one shot. Right, here we go, boys. Career mode time. Do you guys know how this works? You gotta throw both teams in the prem. Although, to be fair, I really don't think any of these teams have a chance to win it. Control our neutral club. And they're both now added into the Champions League. That's not how this works. Whatever team finishes further in the Champions League is your winner today. Let's go.
All right, here it is, boys. I actually think this is going to a vaulted tiebreaker. Also, before I show you the winners, you guys need to let me know what we're doing next week. I want these to be crazy, chat. Like, we need crazy challenges. So give me some actual interesting ones to do down below. And I'll keep thinking, obviously, as well. Right, do we think any of them won the league in the Prem? Not that the Prem matters, but... Oh, my God, the tall team. Oh, the tall team is somehow running away with this. All right, here we go. I just expected better of the short team. Because even though I picked the tall team, the short team has Conte, Varati, uh, uh, Insigne, Mertens. Can still win, though. Here we go. Into the group stage, boys. Where is any of the clubs making it out? Jank is done. So if the short team can just make it out of the group, the tiebreaker is forced. Can they do it? They can. I break it is, boys. Team small lives up to the hype. They get knocked in the round of 16, but it doesn't matter because they force the Volta match. Yo, we have just been doing so many of these as of late. It's been crazy. So for this Volta match, I am on PlayStation. I'm not going to be able to pick the starting 11s. So whoever the CPU goes for the starting 11 is who we're playing with. Let's go. And look at the height difference, man. And the two players on the screen right now. That's so good. Let's run it, boys. I got to go for Team Tall still. But I'm, I low-key think that the short team is going to win it all right here we go kickoff time we're in the warehouse three minute halves let's run it i'm open for a massive game right here and the, the, one of the reasons i think the short team is gonna have this is the skill zone freeze down the wing instead they play it all the way back great passing through him oh it's a chance don't freeze what is going on i just realized they, they don't have slots on out there they didn't put slots on it vault is so good because the tempo of the games bro it's just back and forth chance after chance down in it's a yay team small takes the one new lead as i kind of expected how about this right here oh insigne passed around the back that was nearly an own goal we need some good ones bro we need some skill goals we need some bicycle kicks i feel like we never get that into these vaulted games as high paced as they are instead we just get men sitting on chests or i don't even know what those things are in the background oh my goodness what a chance dude these shots are coming in so fast in one more before the half is over this man is taking over, bro. He literally is taking over this game in Signe. They just left him through and he smashes it. Right there it is, boys. Half one over 2-0. Team small. Dude, team small. Domination. Team tall, bro. I mean, as much as I think the small team's gonna win, bro. Team tall's my team from, from the beginning. I still need them to score. Are they gonna get any goals? Loki don't think so, man. Like, the tall team had the big advantage in the 11v11. But yeah, now that it's 5v5 right here... The small team's got the pace, man. They got the skill. They're just... They got the advantage. Here we go. Come on, dudes. Come on, man. They can't do anything. Oh, how about this? Oh, my God. They still can't do anything. And um, 3-0. Yeah, this game... It's over. Are you sure about that? One more. Come on. Get him one. All right. Hey, hey, hey. It ain't over. We've seen crazier comebacks. 3-1. Yo, we've had... Volta, you can get goals quick, so don't count them out. But no, that's literally what I just did a second ago was count them out. Look, this is what I mean. Come on. Yes. Oh, my God. It's actually gone to 3-2. I love Volta, bro. I actually love Volta. Ah, uh, no. No. Yes. Okay, good. One minute to do this. Will it happen? Come on, boys. Come on team tall we need you we need you please shoot ah, no 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 corner 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 is it it's a goal kick yes boys come on please i'm begging let's go pull her off please don't go backwards do not do come on don't go backwards 30 seconds left we gotta press we gotta go we gotta push it off field we gotta get it in all campos why why is he just shot that with no pace behind it no Oh my god, we're actually... Dudes, we're literally so close. Get it back, please. Please. Get the ball back. Come on. No, it's over. All right, right here. 13 seconds right now, chat. Please, 10 seconds. And they're just passing it around the back. Come on, guys, go. You gotta, you gotta do something. You gotta do something, Ocampos. That's all you have? Team small, bro. Team freaking small wins it. Wow, bro. Us tall people like me, man, we just got, I just got absolutely wrecked. Since I wasn't streaming, there's no, there's no spin of the wheel for this episode. Hey, if you guys want more All-Star Challenges, drop a like. Hey, remember, we got <laughs> our giveaways for today. I'm actually not giving these away. Like, I need, I don't know. I just picked up some random stuff on my desk. You guys are the Jill Bros. Click this to see a random All-Star Challenge that you may not have seen before in the past. Click here to subscribe and here for, like, merch and stuff. It's all linked right here. Love you, boys. See you for the next one.